So I've been seeing a lot of challenges where people will build a house, but each room will have a different set of items. But I was thinking, what if I kind of did that, except I put a twist on it? So in today's video, I'm going to pretty much do the same thing. I'm going to use a generator and then I'm going to pick a number. But the only difference is that every room is going to have the same number of items. All right, so here goes the house and I'm going to show the layout as well. This is what it looks like. So I have one, two, three, four, five. I have five rooms, nothing crazy, nothing insane. Insane. but I'm just really nervous because imagine getting like 50 items I can fill up a living room and a kitchen and a bedroom with 50 items but a garage and a bathroom 50 items oh no and even like vice versa if I got 10 I feel like I'd be okay with here and here but getting 10 in the living room or any of these rooms here it just wouldn't be good for me oh my gosh I think I'm going to set it to like 25 as the minimum and then 100 as the maximum. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, let's see what I get. I don't know if that's good or not. I don't know if I should be worried or not, but we'll just see how this goes. All right, so 58. How the heck am I going to put 58 items in here? I don't even know how many items I use in a single room normally. So I don't even know if that's going to be a struggle or not. I guess I'll just decorate like normally. And then once I get around to the end, that's when I'll start adding like more decorations, I guess. I don't know. I really don't know. Is 58 a lot or a little bit? Anyway, how are you guys doing? I'm doing pretty good. I feel like I'm finally getting back into a groove of being consistent again i finally came up with a schedule and i'm going to try and stick to it it's really funny because i say that like all the time and then i just never do i either end up posting way more than my schedule told me or i post way less i don't know i want to stick to it but it's just hard for me i don't know how people do it in my head i just want to post when i want to post but i'm gonna try and stick to it this time i've been making a lot of videos recently lots of different challenges i have a lot of them pre-filmed actually so that's very exciting i hope over here turns out pretty cute because I want this to be the thumbnail. If it's like part of the build category, I'm not going to consider it except gardens because garden is considered build and decorate. One, two, three, four, five, six. I just counted and I'm only at 11, which is okay. That's not bad. So I'm like almost, almost halfway there. Yeah, I'm like a fourth of the way there. <laughs> I am almost, almost halfway there. Perfect. Oh my gosh, I have no idea what I want to color this. I want to try out new colors, but I don't know what new colors to try. I've never seen this before. This must be new. Okay, this is where we are now and I'm going to count again. One, two, three, four. I only have 24, so that's close to half. Okay, I'm stressing already. I don't know what to do. The one time I'm allowed to over decorate like crazy, I don't know what to do. Ooh, question of the day. I have been forgetting to do questions of the videos. What is wrong with me? I kind of want to make it school related because school is starting soon. Has school started for you? And if not, when does it start? Over here, school starts tomorrow. Wait, today, August 2nd. Yeah, they start today i feel like that's pretty early that's just how it is i guess i heard the school buses outside and i was like this is not okay this is not cool like let the kids have their summer break i feel like june just started i don't know where the time went it just went by so fast i'm gonna color at the end once i'm finished adding all of the decoration i want to add a fan let's try out a new thing i never used this one kind of ugly but i'm trying new things so it'll be fine it'll be fine i literally said i wasn't coloring until i finished and then here i am I'm like why don't I listen? I'm at like 25 items. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I'm actually stuck. So I'm just going to try and like add a bunch of random stuff to the walls. I think that would be the easiest solution for me. I don't know where. Just somewhere. <laughs> Posters, paintings, anything that can go on a wall, it's going on a wall. Okay, I just counted and I have 58 items. It doesn't look like it, but this is actually very hard to do trying to fill up all the space. I thought this was a smart idea over here. Adding a light up there, just little stuff like this little table here too. So now I'm going to color it and then I'm going to move on to the kitchen. All right, the living room is all finished. So now I'm going to do the kitchen over here. Not really looking forward to it, but we'll see. I just find that whenever I do the kitchen, I'm not really good at decorating it a lot. My kitchens tend to be kind of basic and bland and boring. So I don't know. I feel like 58 items is kind of a lot for the kitchen for me personally, because 
because I'm not really a decorator type of girl. I don't really decorate my kitchens like that. Okay, I'm gonna do this wall first and then over here and then I'll do like the little island section in this corner. I should do another version of this where I only use like small amounts. So just now I set the limit to 25 to 100 I think. I should do another version where the max is like 30. I think that'd be very funny. I kind of want to do a green. I saw French roses do a green sink so now I want to do a green sink. What the heck? I did not mean to click that. Yeah, I'm gonna try a green sink. It looks crazy but maybe if I like pretend it doesn't and I kind of just like trick myself into thinking it looks good then it'll start to look good in my head. Oh, I can just copy this whole thing. Oh my gosh, that makes everything so much easier. Okay, I have 25 so that's almost halfway done I guess. I love using these tables instead of actual islands. I think it's really cute, really cute. And then let's get a stool for the other corner. Never use this one. I'm gonna try this one out. I don't like it but I'm just using it just to try something new. Okay, wait, I'm finding it so much easier to decorate here than it was to decorate out here for some reason. I think it's probably because there's more surfaces to cover. Yeah, that's probably it. There's not really that many surfaces in here. Now we're at 37, I just counted again. So I'm going to start decorating some more random stuff here and there, like this bookshelf. I'm gonna put this meshy grid thingy. Does this belong in a kitchen? Not really, do I care? Not really. Let me count again. I keep forgetting what number I left off on. One, two, three, four. Okay, I'm at 45. I can't tell if that's good or not. I don't think that's good because I still have to like add lighting. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Whenever I do kitchens and games, I never do basic appliances like microwaves and toasters. Oh my gosh, I'm having such a hard time trying to flip this. The game literally hates me. This doesn't even look good. Oh my gosh, that's why I never include it. It looks ugly when I do it. I'm gonna add a mat really quickly. And actually no, I want the lined one, the bordered one. Yes, that's here. Okay, and what else? I feel like I'm over budget. Well, it's not even a budget, but limit. I'm over limit, that's what it's called. I'm at 51, so that means I can add seven more items. I think something should go here for sure because over here is just blank and ugly. So here goes one painting. Here goes two, a plant. I did not fill this shelf. I literally left the shelf blank. What is wrong with me? I was not thinking at all. Oh my gosh, but I want the shelf to have something. Three, four, five. I can add one more item because I'm at 57. I really don't know what else to add. So I'm just going to take the easy route and put a light. Okay, so now over here is finished and all I have to do left is color, which is what takes the longest for me. Oh my gosh, I hate coloring so bad. It just takes forever. Ever. I never know what to color. I'm very indecisive. It's just not a good time for me, I fear. So I'm going to do this off camera and then when I'm finished, I'm going to start the next room. Okay, here is how the kitchen is looking. I'm now finished. I'm going to do the bathroom next. I was going to do the bedroom. I talk way too fast. I was going to do the bedroom, but I kind of like bedrooms the most. So I want to save that for last. I'm really nervous for the garage because I normally don't style my garages. So the fact that I have to do this now, I'm actually kind of scared. Well, we shall see, we shall see. I'm actually scared. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I haven't even started yet and I'm already scared. I'm just going to just decorate to the brim. It's like physically impossible for me to over decorate now. It used to be so easy. What happened, Chunky? What happened, Curly Pop? The easy thing though, I can just copy from the other room. So that's kind of not too bad. I forgot to color these books and nobody told me. It's very rude. Okay, wait, this isn't that bad after all. Wait, I'm kind of onto something here. I feel like I'm already halfway done. Let me count to see, am I actually halfway done? One, two. I'm at 27, I'm already halfway done. Oh my gosh, I was stressing for what? This is so easy. I made a freaking life hack. Just copy decoration from other rooms. I did this before in my, um, I I think it was my triangle shaped house video. I like did this little setup here with two different sinks and I've been kind of obsessed. So I'm gonna do it again. Like whoever's using the sink, yeah, you won't be able to see yourself, but like, that's okay. That was so much easier than I thought it would be. I didn't even know why I was stressing out in the first place. I feel like I'm even over limit at this point. So let's see, one, two. I'm at 42. So that's not over limit, but that's still way better than I was expecting me to do. I'm just gonna use the last um, 16 to fill up these shelves here. I'm gonna use actual bathroom things. So like soaps and lotions and stuff. I never ever use these 
these in my builds. I never use them because I hate coloring it. I hate coloring. Coloring in general is just the part that I hate the most about doing builds. So I never really do this. Nobody's deodorant should be bigger than their soap. Like why is the deodorant bigger than the soap? I don't understand. Okay, I'm now at 57 and for the last item, I think I'll just use a toilet paper roll. Where would that even be? I don't know. I'll use this one. Where should it go? Like across from here? <laughs> I mean, it can go to the side. I'll just, actually I'll just change the planter or I'll just put a vase instead. Does that belong in the bathroom? Not really. Do I care? Still not really. Okay, perfect. So now I have my 58 items. The bathroom actually wasn't as hard to do as I thought it would be. I was just kind of nervous without even trying. So I'm glad it didn't take that long. Um, now I'm going to color and then I'm going to move on to the garage. For now, this is how the bathroom's looking like. I think it looks really good. I'm actually really shocked at how well I did. It's kind of giving me hope for the garage. Okay, so I have to do 58 here as well. I don't even Know where to start i guess the main thing would be to like take up the wall space i think that's the easiest method so to do that i'm going to just get like tables i just need things to put stuff on top of so i'm gonna get some tables i'll put some plants on this side so i'll actually take some from out here yes 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 oh my gosh i literally made this life hack just copy decoration from outside because one it's already colored and because two well that's really the main thing because it's already colored like, look at that that was so simple and i just took these from out in the room and outside i don't think the garage is big enough for a car but i definitely can fit a moped or something in here something simple something cute i don't know why i'm so obsessed with this like this doesn't even go in a garage and i'm just so excited to use it we're only at 16 okay that doesn't sound too good okay what can i do oh i did not mean to delete the whole wall now that i'm thinking about it nobody has plants in their garage it's literally going to die there's no sunlight this is not a typical garage i feel like i've already come to terms with this and now i just don't care anymore <laughs> i have a question i guess this can be considered a second question of the video do you guys have a garage in your house and if you do what do you have in your garage because i have a garage but i literally don't have anything in it actually i have one thing i have a beach wagon i just keep it in there so whenever i go grocery shopping or whenever i have something heavy i'll just put it in here and then i'll just take it up to my apartment looking pretty decent decent so far let me count again one two three i'm at 30 so that's over half like just a little over half i don't know what to do now i'm kind of stuck i was kind of going somewhere and now i'm stuck again i hate this so much no one's garage should have this many things inside of it it's just not normal i'm gonna put these boxy thingies i don't even know what these are for what's the smallest they can go i'll just put a couple of these don't know what they're for let's just go through here and find everything oh my gosh this is just i just want to get out of here it's giving office slash bedroom slash garage and i don't know how i quite feel about that it's about two minutes later and it's starting to look very 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 over decorated and i'm just really hoping that it's enough i'm going to count now let's see i'm at 56 okay i just need to add two more things i don't know what to do actually i'm going to do this it's gonna look really stupid but i don't care yes there we go i did my two more things finally i'm done with the garage now i'm going to color it and then i'm going to move on to the last room which is what even is the last room oh the bedroom very very excited to do the bedroom here goes my super duper overly decorated garage honestly it's not the worst i really did think i would have an easy time doing this because the bathroom seemed so simple but it wasn't it was hard it was very very hard but i digress we're finished now i'm going to do the bedroom i'm hoping the bedroom will be easy for me because it's like my favorite room i love doing the bedroom so i don't think it would be too hard wait i kind of ate that up i kind of ate down i need to talk like a human normal people don't say that 24 7. i don't know how i feel about this setup here so i'm simply going to get rid of it i think i would like this more yeah that's way better i like this more the shelves it was just doing three much i fear so how come this can resize this tiny but the smallest these can resize is to here i'm not going to try and make sense of the game that was my first mistake trying to make this game make sense okay i like that way more than the shelving situation i had just now it was just not giving i fear i remember when i first started my channel around 2019 i want to say i don't know what it was but i just didn't use the copy tool i would just make the same things i just wouldn't copy it and i would just waste so much time and now i'm thinking back to that and i'm like chunky why were you like that girly like you could have saved so much time i 
forgot sunflowers existed. I haven't used these sunflowers in ages. And I'm not gonna use them now either. It's just too big. It's taking up too much space. I'm at 45 already. Oh my gosh. I kind of overdid it. Wait, I kind of overdid it. I don't want to be at 45 yet. Let me delete some things. I still have so much I want to do. No, how am I at 45 already? Yeah, I just deleted a few things because I'm not ready to be finished already. I want to decorate. Okay, maybe 58 is too little for in here because there's no way I'm almost done already. I'm not gonna lie. There's starting to be way too many shortcuts in the game. I'm starting to forget what shortcut is for what and it's driving me insane. My goldfish brain cannot keep up, I fear. I'm at 56. I'm at 57. I forgot the curtain. I'm at 57. So I guess I'm pretty much finished now. I'm kind of disappointed. I really wanted to decorate the bedroom a little bit more, but it's okay. It's okay. I'll just add this light here since it is kind of dull still. I'll just add a second light and I'm finished. I guess the next step now is to color. It shouldn't take too long since most of it is colored anyway. Here I am finally done. It took forever to do the decals, but I'm done. Here are the results of my 58 items in each room challenge thingamajiggy. I don't think it looks awful. It looks pretty decent. I think 58 was a decent number to work with. If I ever do this challenge again, I think I'm gonna try and make it more extreme. So I'll either put like 10 through 30 or I'll do like 60 through 100, something like that. So I think 58 was actually the perfect amount. Now for the garage, I'm not gonna lie. The garage, it looks kind of crazy. It was kind of crazy. But for all the other rooms, I think 58 was actually perfect. Um, let me know what you guys think of the actual build itself. I think the build turned out okay. The colors, not so much. I meant to color this. I think I forgot to color this. Yeah, I'm trying to experiment and you can definitely tell. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of it in the comments below. That's all I'm gonna say. So thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys in the next one.